Hey everybody, the Bong is back. Welcome to part 11 of Let's Play Banjo-Tooie, brought to you by GameAnyone.com. Alright, this is World 4, Jolly Rogers Lagoon. So as you can see, it looks to be like an old shanty town. We're just gonna have like a lot of water to deal with, so get that into your heads right now. There will be a lot of water. But for now, let's just deal with what we can outside the water. And collect every single thing we can find that's available to us. Huh. This is Jolly's, apparently. Oh, hello there. I'm Jolly Roger, town mayor and proprietor of this lovely harborside inn. We'd like a ginger beer, please! I'd love to oblige, but I'm less than Jolly at the moment as my partner has gone missing. That's a shame. Now how about that drink? Kazooie? Oh, sorry. Where did you last see her? She was out on a wave racer earlier yesterday evening. I heard a big gulping noise, and when I got outside, she was gone. Perhaps she was eaten by a vicious sea demon. No, oh, I hope not. It's happy hours soon, and I'll be needing some help. Would you like to rent a room? It's half price of two doubloons, as this naughty mole has dug a hole in the corner of it. How about it? Well, I do have two doubloons, so here you go. Okay, big boy, show me the money. Um, that's a little inappropriate. Lovely. I'll just open the door for you, okay? A mole that put a hole in there? Cheers! But how can you possibly sleep while my partner is still missing? Easy. Close my eyes, and then just do nothing. Because that's your problem, not mine. Of course, I'll grab these notes while I still can. They're just calling for me to grab them. Something else over here? We'll just go in the room. I figure that was Jam Jars who did that. Win in the water and Batty's attack! This new move will let you shoot back! Press C up for the aiming sight, followed by Z to start a fight! Oh, now you can actually, like, aim eggs in the water now. That's nice, I guess. Still doesn't change the fact that I could drown. Oh my god, these sheets are so ugly. How can anybody sleep in those? That's ridiculous. Uh, is there anything else here? No. Wait a minute. There's a jukebox. I'm afraid our jukebox is broken at the moment. A real pity. I just love dancing to the salty seaman shant. <laughs> oh my god. Perhaps you'll find a way to fix it? I guess I can think of something. Okay, that did not work. Okay, fair enough. Oh, Treasure Trove Cove! There's an actual painting of that. Avast there, you scurvy dogs! I be Captain Black Eye, fearless pirate and scourge of the seas. You're looking a tad wobbly there, Blackie. Just a touch of seasickness, you filthy rats! Seasick? Some pirate you are! Watch your tongue, buzzard! Oh, that's rude. Huh, they actually got another picture of uh, where you find that egg in Banjo-Kazooie. Apparently there was like some cheat you could actually enter that allowed you to get there. That's pretty cool. It was found in that cave over there. Like, that was pretty much an awesome thing in Banjo-Kazooie history, but it wasn't usable at the time of the game, which was weird. There was a thing called Stop and Swap. So, there you go. That's that. There's nothing else over here, apparently. I guess we will just leave. We'll probably have to come back once we actually do find uh, Jolly's partner, which I assume is in the water. Allegedly... Gulped alive by something? God only knows. <laughs> huh. Pano's Emporium. Okay. Let's see. Huh. BK. Ooh, there's a jiggy. I like to get that. Uh, one free jiggy, please. Greetings, friend. The name's Pano. I'm the local pawnbroker. We're interested in that jiggy in the case. Ah, yes, a real nice piece, circa Banjo-Kazooie. So I was told. I reckon 20 gold doubloons would be a fair price. 20 doubloons? 
We only want the jiggy, not your whole shop. <laughs> wow. Well, at least we can get that globo for free. Oh my god. That's the actual prize from Banjo-Kazooie's, you know, that that game show you had to, like, uh, win to win Tootie back. That was third prize. That was actually pretty hilarious. What was the other prize? Like, it was, maybe it was, like, a washer or dryer or something? Well, we got a Globo, which is pretty nice. Can't do much else. Until we get, what, 20 more doubloons. We already spent, like, two of them just to get that move from Jam Jars. We can pay Mumbo a visit. Why don't we go do that? Because we got other things to do. We need to open this as well. Huh, what is this here? I don't know what I'm going to launch myself to. Maybe up there, somehow. But I can't, because it's a bit too high. What is this called? Wave Racer Higher. I've heard of Wave Race 64, but I've never played it. I don't know, I was more of a Diddy Kong Racing or Mario Kart 64 kind of racer guy. Hey, you again! Oh, hey there. It be your old shipmate, Captain Blubber. How you going, me hearties? Bit of a hard day, really. Aye, these adventures are all the same. So many places to go and things to find. Be standing around, though. How's business, Blubber Guts? Not good, lad lovers. All me wave racers are shipwrecked, and the last one was eaten by a fish yesterday. Perhaps we can land you a doubloon or two. Ah, oh, shipmates. But I will sell you me last possession for just one doubloon. How about it, me hearties? Do you want my last possession for one doubloon? Okay. Or oh, use a good on Banjo. Have a look inside this air crate. Thanks, shipmates. I'll be off to Jolly's for their quiz night. I'll be 1,000 doubloons up for grabs. And if I win, I'll be having me a fine new flying machine. Funny how you say that because you can't actually go to quiz night. Oh! That thing's there. I'll deal with that later, but for now, why don't we go see what else is available? Well, at least health is free. Let me read the sign. If I can actually get on the counter safely. Legend has it that goldfish hold the secret to fast swimming! Well, we're not goldfish, so we gotta deal with it. Oh yeah, well that's an obvious hint that, you know, if you find a goldfish, you can find that ability to swim faster. Which we already did. Oh, looks like there's a Jinjo up here. The orange Jinjo family is complete! They'd like you to have this! Cool. Um, let's do something with this. I do see some water. What if you could actually just run really fast? We find ourselves another black Jinjo. Awesome. Okay, that's a mumbo pad. Cool. Oh, I can't believe I never grabbed that. I should. Mumbo is needed, apparently. There's a couple things over here. Please fix the pool. Piggles pushed me in the other week. And look what's happened to my arm! Well, I didn't want to say anything. Thanks. I'm a little touchy about it, as you might expect. Draco! Huh. Well, you're one arm away from being Goro from Mortal Kombat. Help us sort our pool out, Mr. Bear. What's wrong with it? Looks fine to me. We want to go swimming, but the water's polluted and icy cold. Hmm, well, this one might take some time. Uh, sad but true. I don't think we'd be able to go in there safely, but let's try it. Oh, there's doubloons in here. Okay, so you can actually swim in there safely. That's actually pretty good, and get yourself some free doubloons. I was thinking, you know, you you lose extra air in here for some reason. Given that, you know, it's pretty bad for your health. Jeez, most of the doubloons are actually over here. That's actually pretty good. Got nine already, and I only need, what, eleven more just to get that jiggy. 
Let's see what Mumbo can do here, but for now, let's just activate this. Um, where have I not been? Well, I haven't been over here. He thinks I should activate this. And find yet another doubloon. That's real nice. Uh, can I get up here? On this building? It looks like I should be able to? I don't remember, though. Maybe if I just, like, climb on this. Yep, it looks like you can get on this building. And anytime you can climb something, nine times out of ten, there's something there for you to get. So for starters, why don't we launch ourselves up this way? There we go, now let's see what's over on this side. Other than that jabroni over there that's now dead. <laughs> Serves him right. You could have lived a peaceful life. You made this choice. There, looks like there's an empty honeycomb piece right here. He thinks I should go grab that. Hopefully I don't slide off the pipe automatically, that would be pretty dumb. Okay, there we go, now we got it. Wait a minute. What's in here? Skull! Beach! Beach! Skull! Skull, beach, beach, skull? Is that supposed to be some kind of combination? He thinks that it serves some purpose. I think I'll deal with that later. But for now, now that we got a Globo, let's go talk to Mumbo. Oh, even more doubloons over here! Good to know he was packing some monies! Is there any more? No. Oh, wow! Missed the ramp completely. Good job. There you go. This is yours now. Well, this one you wouldn't be able to give to Wumba anyway. Looks like you have to give it to Mumbo. Because, well, most of the stage is underwater. Needless to say, you cannot survive underwater for that long. Maybe Mumbo can do something about it. And believe it or not, he can. Observe. Eventually. There we go. We'll get up there eventually. Trust me on that one. <laughs> uh, first, let's do something about this. You know it will. Okay, so Mumbo can create sunlight, which will oxygenate the water, meaning you can actually breathe underwater in this stage. Mumbo shine big light on water. It now has plenty oxygen. Bear and bird not need to hold breath in there now. Um, thanks! I feel like this should defy logic, but there we go. We got a way to breathe underwater in this stage. It's only for this stage, though. Too bad Mumbo couldn't do that for, like, every body of water. Like, just cast magic on Banjo-Kazooie. Now, okay, you have lungs slash gills. Have fun. You don't need never needed that goldfish anyway, except to swim faster. I kinda wish Mumbo would have sat on the armrest. That would have been pretty badass. It's like he gives zero craps. Uh there is something else we need to do. Like, I seriously can't reach that. It's like too high for me. I'll have to think of another way. First, let's go to, like, the Turtle View Cave. Oh god, even more doubloons! Jeez, I almost got enough! It ain't happening, lady! You need to get rid of Lardy Boy before you learn this one! Fair enough! Wait, where is a split pad to, then? Okay, I see some turtles. Okay, so we have to look for a split pad. How am I gonna find one then? 
We never found any in the entire area. Unless I gotta climb up another building. Wait a minute, this has a crack. This is all cracked. Maybe if I use a grenade egg. Aha! There we go! That's where the uh, split up pad was. Okay, so you need Kazooie for this one, but if you launch yourself up here with Kazooie only, you actually go up higher. Because you're carrying less weight. Oh, good job there. Now you gotta go up again. You idiot! There, now we have 21 doubloons. 21 gold doubloons! Something, something I can. I don't know, I tried. You've lost the safety that Banjo brings! Defend yourself now with your wings! Roll them round by prison B! Useful attack, I think you'll agree! There, now Kazooie has the ability to attack whenever she wants to. Hmm. Alright, we're back in business now. Let's see, is there anything else we can do? Well, we should get that Jiggy now, over at Pano's. Let's go take care of that right now. We got enough Jiggies to afford it, so we're good to go. I steal 20 doubloons for the Jiggy. Would you like to buy it? What do you say? Here we go. Alright, friend, let's see some gold. Pleasure doing business. Please help yourselves. Oh, he seems so shameful about it. Okay, you I'll put the doubloons in here. You can grab the jiggy. No, there's glass all over the place. I'm gonna cut myself. Thanks a lot. You're welcome. All right, let's go. Why am I having conversations with myself? <laughs> Okay, what else can I do? Can I get up on this building? There's nothing on this building. That's fine. I guess I... Maybe I can do something about those turtles. How the hell did I use my build drill from down here? That's crazy. I thought I was already on the ground. See? Now you don't have to worry about drowning. Right now, we're deep underwater. Okay, this looks weird. And what are these? Apparently, if you just use eggs, you can go grab the notes now. So let me go take care of all of these before we go. I guess you probably only need regular eggs to do this. Yeah, you do. Wait a minute. Why would I do that just to get eggs? If I'm doing this, I already have the eggs, so that's kind of pointless. Okay, for some reason I'm not hitting the eye from here, even though it looks like I'm hitting it. Yeah, you have to aim a little bit better, obviously. Um, is this all the, uh, the anemone I gotta deal with? There was only three, right? Let me go down here. See where this leads. I'm very curious now. It feels so easy to get lost here, it really does. Smuggler's Cavern. Weirdly enough, we've only found, like, what, one warp point throughout the entire place? Ow! That hurts. Let's get back up out of the water. I'm seeing a lot of things with just Kazooie's head on it. Pretty sure there's gonna be a lot of stuff there that only she can do. Having trouble breathing underwater? Go see the shaman! Well, 
we already got that taken care of. Jam jars, okay. We're fine. Wait a minute, how the hell are we back in Jollies? Is there some kind of secret passage or something? Gunpowder. Uh... I have a feeling if we do this, we get it back up. No? Okay. How about grenade eggs, then? Sorry, had to do it. <laughs> um, what was the... Oh, you know what? I think that was only just to serve as a shortcut. I don't really think it did much else, really, to be honest with you. But it was a cool thing to do, regardless. So we'll just go back down. What could be an... Oh, I see something real nice. I think I have an idea of what I need to do. Like, I have the ability to actually just go really far. Which we can't right now. But one day, we'll be able to do that. There's just eggs down here, okay. Hopefully there's nothing big, like, down on the ocean floor, because I'm going to have a hard time seeing it. It's like Super Mario 64 all over the... All over again, like, really. Let me go back this way. Maybe there's, like, another uh, tunnel I can go to. So we're back to the main area. Underwater. Okay, that's fine. But where else can we go? Probably this way. No, that's, that's not even a way to begin with. This is a way. Oh, God. I think this is where your ice eggs are going to serve you well. Yeah, you had to hit him right in the face with that. And it's very precise. I mean, you literally got to hit the head. The tentacles are just going to block the egg attacks. That's why you get those ice eggs in the first place. Huh. We found Atlantis! I never knew it was in a Banjo-Kazooie game. I always thought it was somewhere else in the world, or just a myth. Let me grab this treble clef while we still can! Yes! Good. Good, good, good. You know what we haven't found in a long time? A warp pad. Oh, there's one! Funny how I mentioned that, and lo and behold, there it is. Looks like there's another way up in there. Let me check the top of these, uh, ruins. Might be a good idea to do that. Oh, the camera angles are so weird. seeing a lot of those puffer fish, and it looks like I'm seeing a lot of these here ruins as well. I'm seeing a lot of Banjo-Kazooie's head here. We can't seem to go in here either, can we? Doesn't look like it. Nope, doesn't work. Alright. Probably check out this here place. Looks like this is open. So yeah, it looks like there's two places we can go in now. Electric Eel's Lair. Uh, that does not give me much hope. They gonna be coming after me. I don't like that. There's a move here. Zed launches Burgess, watch her go! Through the water, like torpedo! Control stick to steerings, A for speed, B to cancel if it's banjo you need! The Talon Torpedo, I think this move is going to be very important to take care of stuff. So now that we have it, a lot of this underwater area should be available to us. 
Not to mention anything that we've seen underwater that had Kazooie's head on it. I did not mean to do that, by the way. Oh, wait. I think it consumes feathers. So you won't be able to do it forever. So as long as you have enough feathers, of course. A lot of them transparent fish, too. Yeah, so the transparent fish that you can see over here... Well, you passed it. Ow! Oh, wait, you don't use feathers. All right. Ow! Yeah, if you find the transparent fish, you can use the talent torpedo to actually get through what items they have. So that's a neat move to have available. Let's check out this place first before we deal with the rest. I told you I wasn't a fan of this place for obvious reasons because, I mean, you gotta look all over the place. Seaweed Sanctum. I hear there's lots of seaweed. I feel like they should, like, spring up and attack you. Oh, that one does. Huh. That's what you get for being you. I'm guessing I have to get to the top of this place to find the main reward. Oh god, another one of them. Let's see, we'll just scour this area to see what we can find. Nothing else other than just extra eggs. Oh, we can only go this way. Alright, cool. I can live with that. You might as well just roll into them prematurely to just see what happens. I know there's an entrance way, but what else is over here? Ah, there's a Jinjo! The Brown Jinjo family is complete! Okay, so we're getting more and more uh, Jinjos out of the way. We can go this way now. We should do that. The sea bottom? What is down here then? Okay, I see another one of those transparent fish. Oh, they just give you feathers. Alright, cool. Um, can I go this far? I don't think I can. Oh, you can actually destroy the teeth. Wait a minute, I see something else here. Let me go take care of that. Ah, it's a warp pad. I think I need to take out all of these teeth. So let me just try to get myself calibrated so I can actually hit them. How did that not hit, really? I was dead on. What are you talking about, game? What you talking about, Willis? Oh, I got two of them in a row. Hey! Ow. I actually got hit there. I love how he's just like, knowing these grenade eggs are hitting him in the face, and he's just like, oh, whatever. Look, I don't wanna, look, wanna. I, I'm shooting him, blowing out all his teeth, and he's just like, yeah, whatevs. Like, you don't care. Like, how do you take that approach in life and just do that with a straight face? I mean, really. Yay, we got all the teeth. Okay, it looks like we actually gotta get inside him. Provided that he can just stay in an area where I can just get in there. There we go. This is like Lord Jabu Jabu all over again. Oh my god, 
there's creatures in there. Wait, is that a Jinjo? Apparently there's a Jinjo in here. Where is the Jinjo then? It's in somewhere. Let me check out both uh, tunnels. Oh, there you are. You were in that one. Cool. Well, not exactly that cool. It's pretty gross, but... How the hell did you even get in there? Ew! How'd you get in here? You must be Jolly's partner. Oh, you must be the rescue party. I only have the prices right. I'm Mary Maggie, partner of Jolly Roger. I was out on one of the lover's wave racers when this fish knocked me off and swallowed me. The fish's mouth is open now, so you don't have to stay in here. That's lovely. It'll be soon it'll soon be happy hour at the inn, and Jolly will be needing some relief. Any chance for Jiggy? Oh, see Jolly about that. I'm sure he'll give you one. Oh my god, like how the hell do you walk in those heels? Oh, those tiny legs! I mean, he's got a huge body! I know, that's supposed to be a she, but he talks like a he. <laughs> I definitely don't want to be in here much longer. Uh, we should get out of here while we still can. I mean, we got this taken care of. We're good to go. I think we should claim our reward now, too. Look, the teeth are still on the ground! That's actually pretty cool. I guess. I mean, it's just pretty much the uh, fruits of your labor. Using them grenade eggs. I'll be heading back to town now. Thank you very much. Alright, let's go to the good old, good old Jollies. And I'll be getting my jiggy now. I pretty much earned it. Thanks for rescuing me from the bile-infested innards of that ferocious sea monster. Actually, it was just a very large fish. It seemed like a monster to me. Well, I'm sure it doesn't matter. Thanks for rescuing my partner! Ain't nothing of it! No, honestly, I'm rather pleased. How about a tankard of my finest ginger beer on the house? Perhaps later. Then please accept this modest little trinket instead. Much better than the ginger beer, even though I would like to try ginger beer at some point. I mean, I'm not that far from a liquor store. <laughs> it's just that I can't afford to spend much on liquor all the time. Anyways, I'm going to stop the video right here, and in the next episode, we'll be doing more Jolly Rogers Lagoon. Thanks to the talent torpedo, we should be able to find more stuff. Goodbye, everyone.